Hello and welcome back to more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Now, between the last episode and right now, I played for just over an hour and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I, for some weird reason, thought that this Junon area was just the little section with the new Chocobo Ranch and the little village underneath Junon. I was wrong. I was very much wrong. So, I just done this little photo op here. This is for the guy who asked me to take this. So I know how to use photo mode, happy about that. And I just kind of made my way, like you can see where I've come from basically. So this is Junon that's going up. And then I spoke to the woman, Rhonda, I think her name was, and she asked me to follow a dog. So I followed this dog all the way to here <laughs> and um, yeah basically just looked around and this is where I'm at now. I have like a concern. I really want to know what happens with the story. That's like my number one thing for just now and I'm excited to see new story elements and all of that. Don't get me wrong, I love all of this kind of stuff, but how do I explain this? I kind of just really want to see this the story and it. it's like, do I do just enough, you know? Because even if I play this off camera, I would still be sinking in so many hours and then what would happen is the actual videos to you guys would be quite scarce so I don't know I'm kind of trying to think what I want to do so I've actually made my way over here this place really interested me now I think it was red called it kind of tacky which is quite nasty <laughs> um, not very nice red okay it's not tacky. I'm hoping I can come back to these areas. That was the question I wanted to put out there to the comment section. What is happening they here? Poured their energy into the promotional aspect. They'll be thrilled to hear it. Let's go. I love your hat. So cute. All right. This is a nice place. Also, given that Fort Condor is around here, I mean, this could be Fort Condor for all I know, and I'm just like running straight into it. I don't know, because I don't see no Phoenix up here. Oh, there's like a ton of stuff here. It's like a party. Hello? Greetings. Oh, it's her. And you are. I love your Moogle. Cloud? Kyrie. What the hell are you doing here? Um, just a little business venture. Grandma went off on another one of her tirades. I swore to myself I'd make a killing outside the city so I could rub it in her face. Oh, I've got it. Why don't you come work for me? I could use another Merc, and you're not half bad. Not in a million years. And quit calling yourself a Merc. You're giving the real ones a bad name. Ooh, oh, sassy. Nobody really knows. And besides, arguably this whole mess can be laid at your feet, mister. <sighs> I came all the way out to Junon to strike it rich, but nobody knows we're here, or even that we exist. Zero publicity, which means zero clients. I mean, this is business 101. Ugh. Since you suck so bad at self-promotion, I had to pick up the slack and come up with an ad campaign. But like... What's your brand? Tall, blonde, and not interested? Sounds like a one-way ticket to bankruptcy to me. <laughs> <laughs> Allergies. <laughs> This thing can talk? Indeed. Aww, 
Aren't you just the most adorable boy? Hey, you know, I've always wanted a pet of my own. Come here, come to mama. He's not for sale, he's my boy. Okay, scratch that. Right. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm putting in all this work for us, yet we haven't managed to bring in a single customer. And if we don't get one really soon, your CEO and PR head is as good as done. But not to worry. I put my creative skills to work and came up with this ditty. I love it. Now I understand why the Chocobo has that same hat on. will be lining up in no time. Yeah, and so are the Blobras. Wait, monsters? But what could have drawn them here? I'm sure your aggressive advertising has nothing to do with it. Please, Cloud, you gotta help me. After all, nobody knows how to take down monsters like a Merc. So hire yourself. <laughs> You're a pro, aren't you? Come on, don't be petty. Oh, I'll even give you some of these. I want them. No, 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 we want them. Wait, our lives are in as much danger as hers now. We have to fight. Oh, what are you talking about, Red? It's a blobra, boo. Okay, fine. Girl, I do love your sense of fashion. Very beautiful. I love the Moogles. I love the Moogles get to wear hats. Just gonna take all this good stuff. Right, fine. She gets the best soundtrack as well. Like, there's two of them. Like, should I be scared? Because I'm, I'm not. Right, I'm assuming that they are weak to fire. Ah, uh, she doesn't have fire. He does. Excuse me. Yep, that's what I thought. Oh my goodness, wait. Did more of them just appear? It's on you. Go for it. I'm coming. that because there we go about time so now unfortunately what that means is I'm gonna have to give her a worse weapon so that we can get her to learn the abilities that were on it ah what the heck they look like the cheesecake that I just ate I mean kind of Maybe, maybe not. Fire resistant. All right. What do you think about that, Eris? Arrow? Whoa. Give me back my friend. Oh gosh, Cloud's gonna die. Cloud's gonna die. Oh, there he is. He's fine. He's fine. Just a little 
<laughs> right, I need to know exactly what you are weak against. These guys are strong. Oh no, he's... Stop devouring me! Right, uh, I want to use Assess on him. Oh my gosh, everyone is getting chomped on just now. <laughs> it's so funny. So which one is it that Red needs to use? This one. Of course it's fire. Of course. Oh, look at Eris and Cloud. Like, look at their ATBs at that point. Oh, that's really good. So he's wind resistant, he's fire resistant. Thunder, I don't think he likes. Let me just assess. Everyone is dying! Allow me. Oh. There really isn't a weakness. Absorbs thunder. Everything is good when they're staggered, but to actually get them staggered is the thing of itself. Right. Uh, yes, I know they're in dire need of help. Ooh, red. <laughs> Right, that is it. That is it. We need the chocobo power. We almost have red's limit as well. Yeah, you guys. The choke will come out of nowhere. All right, thank goodness. It's just so funny seeing the chocobo going at it. No, you ain't devouring me. Right, red. What level were these guys? Does it give them? Do we even do levels in this game? Just giving me their HP. Uh, we get an ether onion. Whatever that means. I don't know what that means. Da -da -da. It's on you. Go for it. Nice. Right, we're just going for arrow because that seems to be the one. Listen, the chocobos are doing their thing, okay? Good job. 
think I almost died. Lend me your strength. Watch out for high winds. <laughs> You learned something. Yeah. Oh, well, guess I'll just have to close up shop and clear out. Anyway, I'm gonna split, but I'm sure you can take it from here. Catch you later, fellow Mer. Hey. Oh, I got the chocobo gear. Wanna leave with Mama? Come on, you know you do. <sighs> okay, later. I wouldn't wish her on my worst enemy. You and wow. Me both. Red really did not like her too much. I saw the monsters headed your way. I couldn't help but worry. But it looks like I worried for nothing. I should have known Avalanche could hold their own. Out of curiosity, what happened to that Merc? She moved on. Bummer. Well, guess we should get this place cleaned up. Oh, yeah. Rondo was telling me you do Merc work on the side, too. For real? I can't believe you didn't say anything. Best buds don't keep secrets, you know. But I hope you'll lend me a hand the next time I need help. Best buds? Um... Sure. Let's go with that. Right. There is a ton of things that I could be doing around here. But... I know that we can come back to it and we can kick some booty. Maybe when we get the, um, like the, the boat or something like that a little bit later on. But for now, cause I could spend like a good 10, 15 hours just messing about here. So I'm gonna go, is this the one I want? I'm ready to see what is up there, you guys. Yeah, I just... I don't know why, but I didn't think that I was actually able to leave that area. <laughs> yeah, so... When I ended up leaving, following the dog, I was like, wait, what? Like, Junon is this big? Oh, okay then. But it's fine. I tried my hardest as well to beat the guy that was the fisherman. Hey, what were you thinking sending Sam back alone like that? He even need us in the first place? Your mother'd give Steph a run for his money. <laughs> so, how's my son? Seem okay? Yeah. You're gonna stand there and pretend this wasn't all about Claire and her bun in the oven? <laughs> Apple didn't fall far from this stubborn ass tree. That's for damn sure. <laughs> Wouldn't know about that. And if you're done making wisecracks, I got work to do. I don't know what really happened between those two, but it must be hard knowing that you're about to be a granny and they're far away from you and they're not really like that interested. Hey there! Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. You did me a good turn, so I did you one too. I convinced the association to make you a member. Of course, you're starting on the bottom rung, but you'll work your way up. And the more locations you find, the faster you'll climb that ladder. Nice! I am now an amateur photographer. I think my photo was alright. I wonder if I can show it to you. Um, maybe not with that one. I don't think I can. 
Oh, by the way, I learned how to change party members. <laughs> it's so strange because you don't change party members in party. You change them in combat settings. Which is really weird, but anyways, that is how you do it. And you're damn right I had to look it up to see how to do it. <laughs> I don't know why I just didn't go through all my menus, but I didn't. All good to go. So, you're not going to be able to return to under Junon for some time. To under Junon, so maybe I can still go do other stuff. Hmm, maybe not. All right, let's do it. I'm excited. I'm just going for a little swim with my dolphin. Dolphins are adorable. My brother went to Mexico, I think, for his honeymoon, and he got to swim with dolphins. Okay. Steer Mr. Dolphin into the beach balls he loves so much to get him excited and speed up. Okay, so it's like Crash 3. <laughs> if you are swimming fast enough by the time you reach the goal, he will be able to launch Cloud up to the control room. Right. Got this. Come on, Cloud. You got this. Listen, it'll take me a few attempts, okay? Let's go, Dolphy! Whee! Oh, oh, whoa, hey! Okay. Well, that's not a balloon! Oh, wow, he's going fast. Like, where am I going? I. Oh, sorry, boy. Sorry. This is hard. It's hard because it keeps focusing on the arrows. I wish it would stop doing that. Because all I want to do then is bloody go into them. That was horrible. I shouldn't have made that. I should not have made that. I was terrible. I was terrible. Like, I missed most of the balloons. All right. I, listen, these things happen, I suppose. Hold on, it's inverted. So lower the tanker into the cove. Why does it feel like I'm going up, but I'm pressing down? That was so weird on my brain. I was pressing down on the analog, but it felt like I was going up. So strange. There we go. You telling me that someone around this area hasn't noticed that just happened. Okay, your ride's right here. The ship's not far, so you'll be there in no time. Aww. Bat it. Stop it. <laughs> We're only gonna sink because you weigh a ton. like this at the front for dear life. Hey, Mark. We're good 
to go down here. There's just no way. There's no way that they could get away with doing this, given that there is Junon soldiers around the area. They wouldn't even let us into the place. But we can move this? questioning anything anymore. It's beautiful though, isn't it? Oh man, gives me chills. And also, Junon is on the way to Cosmo Canyon. And Costa del Sol. Can't wait. Can't wait. I am joining your parade. This is gonna be good. So I wonder when I'm gonna get changed. Oh, never mind. Hello. Ah, oh, there you are. Let's move. So serious all the time. We're obviously gonna cause some amount of mayhem, so I can understand why we're not gonna be coming back to Junon anytime soon. I feel like I should change my party, but I'm so comfortable with Red and Eris, you know? Eris is great because she's a mage and she has prayer. Oh, hi guys. Okay. Time to win that commendation. I really thought they would have had an issue with us. Everyone knows our face, right? At least they should. Avalanche are like the biggest things. security than I thought. More worried about the parade? <laughs> Guess things have changed. They got higher priorities. Personally, I think that's a good thing. The city's size, on the other hand. The robed men won't be easy to find. And they're definitely not here. Let's head into town. Yeah, we're okay, just... Not let me go away. Not on our own home turf. We are running past all these guys, so this shouldn't be good. The highway. Generous pride and joy. The fastest, most advanced airship and fleet. The highway. Unless you got a trained crew and piloting skills we don't know about, we're sticking with the boat. Lesson, give it time, okay? Give it time. Hey, beggars can't be choosers. I'm like, can I just run over here? No. No way. There's no way that they would let us do that. I'm just like... Yeah, best not to get any closer. <laughs> That's what I thought. I was like, when is it gonna tell me? 
I shouldn't be here anyway. Right, I need to go down. Hey everyone! Don't mind me. Just taking a look around. <laughs> Hello! They would all be staring at us like, why is there all these people? One man with a gun on his arm as well. Have you seen the engine? This Shinra isn't. That's the ticket. Do we have to go to that social for the Midgard unit? Word of advice, do not piss off the I didn't come this way because, in all honesty, I didn't think it would let us go past all of those guards. That's crazy. Alright. Fine. They must have known it was us. No. We'll leave them be. For now. Enter. An emissary from Wutai is here, sent by Viceroy Saruf. Oh? He introduced himself as Colonel Glenn Ladbrock. All right. Pretending to be like them, huh? I thought you were dead. <laughs> Then you thought right. Let's cut to the chase, Mr. President. The Viceroy and your late father had big plans. I assume you intend to carry them out? Correct. That's good to hear. Some people just don't have the stomach for war. And this battle for the Magnus Materia demands commitment from both Wutai and Shinra. Thank you, I'm aware. But my father is dead, which changes the equation. A new vision is required. <laughs> you always did prefer to march to the beat of your own drum. This new vision include your fairy tale promised land? <laughs> you Shinras, you take and you take, you never give back. Left to you, this world would end up an empty husk. But war can put things right, beget anger. Desolation, hatred, and in its wake, new unity. A people rejuvenated, and a planet once more made whole. What we're doing's for the greater good. Just gotta know when to ease off the gas. Now listen. Oh, Ruth is in this place. Remember. No more playing the idle air. You have obligations to fulfill. <laughs> Let's give the people what they deserve. Oh, right. Before I leave, a message from the Viceroy. Congratulations on your inauguration, Mr. President. Shinra has a bright future. Oh, 
someone making him mad. Rufus got them like evil behind his eyes, you know? Hi guys, I know we look different. I know we're also going around with Eris, which is like a major no-no, but please continue to ignore me. Thank you very much. It's just so weird, you know. In the original, we came up here and the first thing that Cloud did was get changed. Because otherwise it was just, you're gonna get spotted, you know, it's not good. It's a key military outpost with its own offshore reactor. A critical line of defense against any seaborne assault. When needed, it can transform into an armed fortress. Its strategic location, along with its air and sea ports, make it second only to Midgar as the company's most vital city. Huh. Neat. Any good restaurants? Sights to see? Uh, maybe? I don't know. Ah, uh, right. You're not the touristy type. Hey, just to be clear. You do realize we're not here on vacation, right? Uh, of course I do. Hey, look, what's that about? Listen up. Midgar's 7th Infantry will return home with the President's commendation. Let's show him how a real drill team does it and make our city proud. <laughs> Troopers, you're all off duty until the parade begins. But use this time wisely. Practice your technique. <laughs> I was meant to be a part of that. So again, that's something in the original where um, Cloud is dressed up and he's like a part of the drills and things like that. Eris, you need to kind of start taking things a little bit more seriously. For the parade, huh? More like eager to prance around for the new paymaster. <laughs> Now, I know what y'all gonna say, but I gotta ask. What? If Rufus is in town, are we really gonna let this opportunity pass us by? Hmm. Hell, I'm not saying we kill the man, but we ought to at least give him a talking to. Rough him up a little, maybe, you know? Actually, I'm gonna have to agree. First, the Turks say, do whatever, we're not after you. But then, Cloud's biker buddy rolls up and says, he is. We gotta straighten this out. Okay, but how? We can't just walk up to the president in the street. Disguise! Gotta be a disguise! Or maybe we can. Huh? We bust up his parade! No. That's how we die in a hail of bullets like a bunch of dumbasses. The city's crawling with Shinra troopers. We join the parade. Hide in plain sight. Get in, get close, get answers. Seriously? Sure. Wow, that's good. No arguments here. <laughs> Barrett, Fred, you guys find a route to the port. See what security's like. And keep an eye out for black robes while you're at it. Now hold up! Fatigues won't be enough to disguise you two. <laughs> yeah, the arm might be a dead giveaway. And Red, you're a dog! Shut up. Alright, see you in a bit. I gotta go find a uniform. Oh, we're coming with. I'm so pumped for this. This way? Yeah. Cloud, you always get the ladies. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Attention all troopers. Spare uniforms can be found here. Please wow, that was change. good. The ceremony will be starting soon. Now we're talking. Wait, are the girls doing it too? No way. Yeah, actually kind of cool. Well, ready to suit up? Yep. Yeah. 
I didn't think the girls were gonna do it. Oh, it's so cool. How do we get our old clothes back, Can though? Back, if you please. <laughs> oh my god, their feet! That's what all the boys would be saying. <laughs> Hello, old friend. Right, give me mine then, I suppose. In a while. I'm just like, oh. I wasn't expecting that the girls would also be a part of this. I love it. We need to get like a picture of the three of them together, you know, like, peace. Oh man. <laughs> well. Well. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was gonna have to pick one of them. I'd say we to be like, hard. oh, you look beautiful, or you look beautiful. You gotta act the part too. Just do what I do. All right. So before that, oh, look at them. We need to double check on Tifa if she is going to be. Oh, okay. What does she have? Fire, lightning, and. How long before this levels up? Oh my gosh, 300? <gasps> That's ages away. There we go. Just in case we run into any trouble. I mean, the sword's kind of a giveaway. seeing the three of you at practice am i to assume that you simply forgot sorry sir <gasps> sorry sir you're sorry do you have any idea how important today's ceremony is do you maggot form check now you will give your commander a flawless performance. Oh no. Okay, I'm ready with the quick time. Anything less than perfection. I'll feed your ass to a behemoth. Now what? Just follow my lead. I still remember the basics. I'm having second thoughts, you guys. What the hell are you doing over there? The commander is waiting! Sir! Oh man, we don't get to back out now. Oh shoot! Attention! Attention! Have to hand it to you three. You've got guts skipping out on practice. That, or you're idiots. Let's find out, shall we? I'm not about to take any chances today. I'm warning you now, though. One slip up, and I'll chuck you straight into a Marlboro's mouth. Clear? Clear. Oh, gosh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'm so excited. Okay, performing in the parade. Press the corresponding button when the glowing guide marker connects with the panel to improve your drills team synchronicity and impress the crowd da, 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 da. right i was gonna do my best um so all i have to remember is blue is hold the button da, 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 here see we go what Begin. I'm ready. Look at 
these girls, man. Okay, I mean, it wasn't bad, right? There, okay, there was some bad in there. All right, What's right. Going? I didn't understand the holding and the tapping one. Let's see what you've got now. That was almost late, that one. Not good enough. What? I, I was fine. Thank you very much. I will take that. No. I think even the game wanted me to practice Precise, once more. Clean movements. Impeccable time. I must say, you've impressed me. <clears throat> He'd serve as a sterling example to the others, ma'am. Congratulations! You are hereby promoted to Parade Captain of Midgar 7th Infantry. What? Oh, gosh. You will be our model trooper, the one to march at the head of our drill team. Which means that our performance, satisfactory or otherwise, is now your responsibility. That's not okay, I guess. Well, it's a good job. You don't know what Avalanche look like. As parade captain, you will round up your fellow troopers currently on leave in Larvor Junon. You will recall that to march in the parade, each drill team is required to muster five units or more. Look for the seven Sprassards. They'll identify the best from the rest. Once assembled, you and the team will report to Starboard Junon. Tardiness will not be tolerated. Now, make us proud. Ma yes, ma'am. Well, I didn't expect that to go as well as that. But anyways, as parade captain, it falls to you to locate the 7th in Infantry's disparate units and assemble your drill team. When you've found at least five units, you can fine-tune your performance lineup. Okay. Note that certain units unlock different formations. Successfully proving more difficult formations will improve your rating. But what about my girls? Why <laughs> not just use them? Boy, that was lucky. Hey, you sure about this? Is the parade really gonna get us to Rufus? The parade won't, but the presidential commendation will. That's how these things go. The president himself gives the award. Wow, that's some plan. I mean, it's risky, but gotta go big or go home, right? Okay, locate the seventh in infantry, and there is ten. 
Right, so do I want to just take the elevator down then and go see people? I still think that Barrett and Red could have done a good job. Who knows? Yes! Cool. Ready to rally the troops, Captain? Yeah. Just remember, Midgar, 7th Infantry. Anyone with one of these guys, right? Come on. Look at her. She is into this. Where in the heck would they be? Is there a local pub anyways? Because that's what I'm thinking anyway. They're not going to be in a bookstore. No. I just, I seen red on their arms. Is that who I think it is? <laughs> is that rude? Very fishy. They won't know it's me anyway, so it's fine. Why is everyone bald in here? Hmm. <laughs> what? Brute, you mind? Is this your first time? Oh God. You drink with us. You're gonna have to lose the helmets. We can't. No scalp, no service. <laughs> A weekend. Um, just walk out, leave. What are you waiting for? Unless, are you three mop heads? Wait, he's our new captain. He didn't know. <sighs> Sir, this place is for the clean shaven. You need to prove that you belong or leave. So what do you want me to do? Shave my head now? Seven. Outside. Sir. Right away, sir. I was lucky. Okay. Wait, that was one? That was like ten people. Hey, if you want to drink here, the helmet has to go. Well, I'm not here to drink. I am here to uh get their asses back to work all right i'm not taking my helmet off so we're done with that okay like how many is that that's eight people as class as one okay that's fine on to the next that was lucky though all right, the barracks lobby. It's quite a good mission because it will force you to have a look around the place. Why would you have that in the corner like that? What is this? Okay. Don't mind me. How excited are you to participate in today's parade? Very. All of us in the 7th have been practicing like crazy. Day in and day out, drilling every little detail. I just hope that hard work comes through in our performance. And that it gives everyone who came out to support our new president something else to cheer about. I'm sure it will. But before we let you go, is there anything you'd like to say to the folks back in Midgar? This is a what are you doing? difficult time for our city. But when you see us marching today, just know this. We're marching for you. Uh, excuse me, but we're in the middle of an interview. Don't care. We got places to be. Good day, Captain. Uh, oh, you're
you're their captain. This is perfect. If you have a moment, I'd love to ask you some questions about the parade. Uh, sorry, but... How do you plan to set your team apart from the competition? Are there any special routines you've been practicing? We, uh... Well, um... Right, I see what you mean, Captain. We can't go spilling our secrets to anyone who asks, especially on camera. Break time's over, people. The parade's about to begin. Follow me. Sir! I can't go spilling my secrets. Who do you think you are? What's going on here? Alright, that is two. Sound very strange happening there. I wonder if there's any more people up the stairs. Man, I can't wait to see the mobile unit tear it up. Hello. Now, buddy. We're busy. Uh Listen to me, Mr. Busy. Practice is over. Time for the real deal. With me. Yes, sir. <laughs> what is this? All right, that's three. Excuse me, girls. As much as I love your outfits, eh, yeah. I think I'll uh, prefer it when we go to Costa del Sol. I can't wait to see Cloud's reaction actually to um, them in swimwear. I'm assuming they're gonna be in swimwear anyways. Is anyone down the stairs? I didn't go down. Hello, anybody here? President Shinra merchandise. I sure hope okay. we can get an accommodation. I feel like I should go back in there because there was other ways oh, that you could go. I was running into everyone and I feel so guilty about it. Okay, so that was fine. Let's have a look down this way. Jesus! Are they just gonna follow me everywhere? Like that was terrifying. Oh my gosh. Just uh stay there, okay? So Rufus is the son of And I need to find the rest of you. You know, if everybody actually stopped and had a look for a second, then maybe we would find them faster. Albia, can we help you? We're kind of in the middle of something. Check the helmet. Captain! I, I did it! I'm sorry, sir! Break time's over. Outside. Now. Yes, yes sir! <laughs> I can't deal. What a beautiful bar. Okay, ain't no jumping out the window. Okay, so that is the end of this section. Fast! There's so many of them. It's terrifying. Right, let's make our way up the stairs and see if I can find any up here. You don't think what? But I'm a captain. Why would it be restricted? I'm looking for my drunken friends. Have you seen him? Oh my god. Looking forward to a celebratory Nice uniforms. Aw, how'd you know it was us? By your scent. That is some nose you got there, Red. Leaving the Mako-soaked streets of Midgar behind has done wonders for my faculties. And though this place is starting to take its toll. Aw. It's like all the kids there. Eh, so I've already done in there. Right, I think that is the end of that area. Ah, it's so cool! <laughs> um... 
Okay, but where the heck are the rest of them? Are they up here? No more that way. Damn. What? We're trying to enjoy the view. Look at the headgear, dude. Oh. Um. I. Uh, Captain. Get your shit together. Parade's about to begin. Everyone, follow me. Yes, sir. Love the way they run. I wonder what they're looking at over there. Wait. It's saying I've done it, but that's only five of ten. Or is that? Hey guys! <laughs> it's so funny. They just keep following me everywhere. Like, ah, they're coming so fast! No! Thank you. Why does it say five of ten? Midgar, Seventh Infantry, reporting is ordered, ma'am. And on time. Good. <laughs> the parade is scheduled to begin shortly. I trust your team is ready, Captain. Um, where can I find more troops? <laughs> Still haven't assembled your team, Captain. A few might have decided to visit Junon's most famous site. Get your team in order, Captain. Most famous site? I don't know. Like, what am I actually doing here? Okay, so it's for the buttons. Okay, so... I, I, I don't know what. Does that seem right to you guys? Because I don't know. Ah, let's just, I keep saying no. Screw it, let's go. I just feel like there must have been more people somewhere. Midgar 7th Infantry, attention! You're on. Listen up. As we march, the eyes of the whole world will be watching us. Oh, great. And we, uh... And we cannot, we will not, let our great city of Midgar down. Failure is not an option. It's a big ask, but we can do it, together. Because we have our captain to guide us. Look to him, trust in him. And he will lead us to victory, so long as we follow. Isn't that Teamwork. right, sir? Uh, right. Cloud ain't one for speeches, is he? Today is our day. It was made for the 7th Infantry. We will win that commendation for our city. And we will return home as champions. Yes, sir! Who's gonna show the rest of them how it's done? We are! I can't hear you! We are! <laughs> Cloud's feeling it, man. He's feeling it. Captain, the parade's about to start. Don't wanna be late, sir. Of course. <laughs> he was just like too into that for a second there. When did we last use her? 
Five years ago, sir. Let's blow off the dust. But, but, sir. Even a ceremonial display would constitute a violation of the ceasefire. Wutai would view it as a willful act of aggression. And? It's a new era. Let's ring it in with a bang. <laughs> Very good, sir. Very good. Nothing like fireworks to rouse the spirits. Mr. President, it's time. God, imagine working for that side and you've just overheard that conversation. You'd be terrified. Look how busy it is here. Damn. Yeah. This way. Welcome to the celebration of the century. As you can see, the streets of Junan are abuzz with excitement. People have turned out in droves to catch a glimpse of the new president, Rufus Shinra. And here comes Midgar's mobile unit. Their incredible skills are truly a sight to behold. This is not possible. Nice car, though. There he is, folks. Rufus Shinra. Wow, can you even hear me over this crowd? Uh, the president has stopped. They're seriously gonna fire when everyone's there? Okay, that's something to be seen. Ready to fire, sir. Welcome to the New World Order. Oh my god. Fire! Eek! Ladies and gentlemen, with a single blast of Junon's famous cannon, Rufus Shinra has announced his arrival. <sighs> Too bad it's not just for the parade, though, huh? Join us in Starboard Junon as the final team of the day takes their position. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Midgar 7th Infantry. The captain and his Here team we go! Long and hard. I am not gonna to mess it up. I have trained for this. For everyone back I am the Midgar. best at this. I can't wait to see what kind of performance they'll put on today. Troopers of the 7th Infantry make us proud. I'm ready. It's okay. Team. Halt! First sequence, begin! They did practice, right? That's not a good start. Oh my god, it's so distracting. So far, so good. Formation, change! You're watching history in the making, folks. They're in perfect sync. Final sink. sequence. Begin. That practice is paying off. Are you too bad? Concludes the first part of today's performance by the Seventh Infantry Drill Team. Okay, I got a lot more happy faces. the votes from you, the viewers, and here they are now. Based on that, the Seventh is off to a solid start. But can they build on this beginning? 
Let's see what they do next. This is so cool. Left. Face. First sequence. Begin. concludes the second part of their performance as ever oh, our judges oh, have been busy TV. tallying oh, all the points we've received so let's take a look at the results clearly there were a few moments when they weren't quite in sync but the captain mostly kept his team on track i did my best okay my circle button's broken Here's hoping they're setting the stage for an impressive finale okay here we go Formation change. This is looking promising. Final sequence. Begin. Such excellent direction. They don't ah! seem to be coordinated. work oh that's going to cost them it all looks a little stiff shut up what a performance I got two bad and 17 grades you're gonna be that rude to me and with that we reached the end of the seven <laughs> infantry's performance. Oh. Uh, uh, sorry about that. For the final time, the judges no, are doing the I got over 10k bad. Now, let's see the results. In the end, then, Midgar 7th provided a satisfying conclusion to today's parade. But the question remains, will their efforts be enough to impress our new president? Let's wait and see. I think I did a good job. Yes, sir. Around the clock. They remain unaware. Leave them to me. I want you and your people tracking the ropes. Understood. Her eyes kind of stand out. Just a wee bit. We're back on the clock. I trust you know the mission by now. to congratulate you on the stirring performance. You've done your company proud. Your passion and patriotism is beyond question. And I know our president can't wait to thank you all. <clears throat> of course, some among you are deserving of special praise. For our first award, we will recognize the division whose exemplary display eclipsed all others. The prize for outstanding performance goes to... Come on! Come on, 
I did it. I did it. Midgar's mobile unit. What? We practiced. Come on up, Commander. Aye, aye. So it seems like we did all of that. Oh my god. Just for the fun of it. I mean, what were we gonna do? Get up that close and then what? Shoot him in the face? Next, we have the President's Commendation. If you would do the honor, sir. The late President, my father, single-handedly turned a small arms manufacturer into the greatest company the world has ever seen and transform all of our lives with the miracle of Mako. So I invite you to join me in a moment of silence for a great man gone too soon. We live in challenging times. Some may feel that I am too young too inexperienced to lead us. But to them and to you all, I say this. Screw you! The Shinra Electric Power Company will endure. The challenges we face can be overcome if we summon our courage and cut ties with the past. Yesterday is behind us. We must look instead to the promise of tomorrow. For today is a new day. And the first of a long, arduous journey which we must take together. Follow me, and we will reach our promised land. This I do solemnly swear before you all, as president of the Shinra Electric Power Company. My friends, place your trust in me, and together will we achieve our dream of a better world. That wasn't bad. Wasn't bad at all. Have a commendation to present. Why do I feel like I don't want to win this one? The award goes to Midgar's Seventh Infantry. Yes! I am the best. I am the best. Better than all the rest. <laughs> Oh my gosh, now I'm like, what's gonna happen? To accept this award on behalf of the team... Uh-oh. Three of the best will now join me. Come on up. Uh oh. Ah, just the way the camera went on the men. Where's Barrett and Reg? Salute! Your performance today was nothing short of incredible. Midgar's 7th Infantry is, without a doubt, the pride of our people. Congratulations. Hmm. Hmm? I have a few private words to say to these troopers. Cut the feed. Sir, you, you're on crowd control. Hard work and dedication won you 
talk to the rank and file why not take off your helmet cloud strife oh god i knew this that wasn't was a, a good idea performance one worthy of a soldier oh my god if he knows you don't need to take off your helmets oh, you Stand down. But, sir! Why do I feel like Yuffie's gonna save the day you here? You are a fascinating individual, Cloud Strife. Your file was as gripping as it was enlightening. Which is why I have a proposition for you. At present, Midgar requires my full and undivided attention. The city is Shinra's beating heart. Its devastation is a humiliation, and the world must see us rebuild. To that end, I need to refocus my efforts and push certain duties to one side. Get to the point. My father left me a mountain of unfinished tasks, like the recapture of a fugitive, of ancient descent the recovery of a stolen lab specimen no and of course the arrest and execution of avalanche none of which frankly are of any interest to me whatsoever i'd gladly wash my hands of it all so what you're gonna let us go just like that yes Provided you keep your distance from Midgar, that is. No more stirring the proverbial pot. And the same goes for me? But why? Because I have a new vision for Shinra. So we go free. And you get... Sephiroth, dead. <laughs> Oh. He's an unsavory relic of our past, and I want him gone. But in our current state, Shinra lacks the resources to get the job done. So I turn to you. This just deal. makes so much sense. You have a lead, I take it. The guys in black robes. Clever you. You know who they are, don't you? According to Hojo, they're connected to Sephiroth. Shadows of the Man, I believe he called them. Follow them and you'll find him. Right. Oh my god. What is Yuffie gonna do now? Everything is going as it should. How oh, cool! Alright, girl. You can't be trusted, but I love her. I love that her outfit is back and she's in hiding again and oh, she's great, isn't she? I can't believe though that Barrett is dressed up as a sailor. I was kind of hoping that Red would also be dressed up as the sailor because I remember him being like, this is really uncomfortable to wear, and it's horrible, and... Shit. I don't see Little Miss Ninja anywhere. Do you? No, but you can't have gone far. I can't have gone far, just that I've gone high. I mean, ultimately, her mission here is to kill Rufus. So, if she succeeds here, this is gonna cause.
cause us all sorts of issues. Look, up there. Oh no. Don't do it now. Not in front of all these people. Are you crazy? No, this is not a good idea. No. Oh, so non. All right, Shinra, time to pay. I understand why she's doing it. I do. Oh my god. Oh my god. No way. You want me to do this? Okay, okay, I will try my hardest to make this all terrible. Right. Okay. Okay. Focus. I'm focused. So, we have ourselves a deal then. Only if you can honor it. No one comes for us. Not Hojo, not the Turks, no one. <laughs> you have my word. Bloody hell. Ugh. Okay, just shake it off. Take your time. You know you can do this. <laughs> this seems so wrong. Here goes. Gotcha. Stop! Oh my god! Get down! Oh! Get over here! Ah, uh, so that's your game. It wasn't us. Spare me. You had your chance. This has nothing to do with us. You be, you idiot! Swing the rooftops now! Don't let them get away! Ah, uh, you see you're a moron. That you wasn't the time! Was right? Yep. What do we do? Get the hell out of here. I knew that was all gonna be too good to be true. What happened to Rufus? Long gone. Shit. So what now? I saw one of the robed men. He was headed for the port. Let's follow him. Place is on alert. Are you sure about that? We've still got the uniforms. Go on without me. I'll take care of the 7th Infantry. Throw him off the scent. Alone? You sure? Trust me. It's easier this way. Captain! Get going. Oh, thank you. Nice guy. Sorry, your orders. Just received new intel. The suspect is en route to Larboard Junon. I'm to convey this information to all nearby units. Go join the search. I'll catch up. If I may, sir. We've heard rumors that there are others in league with the terrorist. Conspirators in stolen uniforms. For your own safety, sir, allow us to accompany you. Ah! Midgar 7th Infantry never leaves a man behind! Right. If the enemy is among us, other units are a potential threat, and we must treat them as such. Uh, good point. But you can trust us, sir. Like we trust you. Oh, this is such a shame! Like, yeah, trusting me. Yeah, that's right. We'll alert oh. all units from here to the port elevator. When that's done, we'll regroup with the rest in Larbor Juno. Got it? Yes, sir! Trust me, bro. Damn it. Five members of the 7th Infantry will join you as you make for Jun and Seaport. Unafraid to lay down their lives for their captain, these troopers will assist you in combat. However, they can be attacked and even defeated should their HP fall to zero. So see that they make it to the port alive. It's kind of cute. I don't know why. 
Just the fact a rune blade. Hello. It's kind of cute that they're here with me. Wait, what? I mean, it's good with magic, but it's not good for attacks. So I am not, I am not gonna use that just now. Okay, let's see, what's this one? There's no Tifa just now. Let's go for that. Right, any goodies for me? Whoopsies. Okay, I don't know if I actually need to sit down and heal, but let's make our way to the boat. The music is so good. It's like such a good rendition on what we already have, you know? Okay, let's go. We can't be that far. Hopefully you guys all survive. It's so funny, it's like, the captain needs us, it's like, uh, yeah, about that, sure, why not. Don't you hurt my men! My god. Trooper C, man, you're gonna die. It's interesting that they don't even question. Like, they've never seen Cloud with his mask off. Or maybe they've seen someone with the mask off. Why do I feel like this room is important <laughs> is it true someone tried to kill the president that's correct the latest report is that the assailant fled to larboard juno shit well here if you run into that bastard perfect thank you i want to talk to more people if they're gonna give me things like that whoa that gave me such a fright did you throw a grenade? Just like that, okay? Right, I'm gonna cure really quickly. You don't think the enemy is infiltrated the seventh, do you? Never doubt your brothers. Yes, sir! Oh man, he's saying all these things and it's just so sad. God. Never doubt your brothers. And all this coming from the guy that shouldn't be there.
like really not necessary, you know. but I feel like we should have the, the Moogle anyway. <laughs> yeah, let's go! I mean, what person wants to harm a Moogle? Like, seriously. Can I cure someone? Like... We're not losing anyone. I mean, we, we might, but... It'd be nice not to, although I feel like they're all gonna die anyway. But maybe that's just really negative. Whoops, sorry, 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 sorry. Do you hear anything more about that assassin? Only that they've been spotted in the area of Barbor Juno. Nothing else to report. Alright. Well, thanks for the update. Nice. I would like to keep them alive, so I'm gonna take this seriously now. Here we go. Let's make this quick. Oh no. Ah, uh, of course. Of course I don't have... I don't have thunder. Because my limit is nowhere near as well. I wanna give that to Trooper A. Perfect. 
Sentry A is getting his butt handed to him. Okay, everyone is still alive! Can you actually believe it? Because I can't. I was just double checking then. I was like, A, B, C, D, E. Yes, everyone is still alive. Thankfully. Perhaps it's time we return to Larbor Junon, sir? Indulge me, trooper. Yes, sir! I wonder if they could have all been dead by this point. Protect the captain! You're out of time! Huh, what? It's kind of annoying because, I mean, this guy doesn't keep still for one. Let me assess you. Oh, he's weak to tons of things. I was assuming he was going to be weak to only thunder, but it's not there. Okay. Dude. Seriously. Keep everyone alive. Nice. Did you see that though? One of them actually used a potion on me, which was very kind of them. Uh oh, uh oh. Why do I need this? What boss are you about to give me? But that was nice because it healed up all my guys as well. Oh, hi, Roche. You really ought to have told me you wanted to join the parade, my friend. Oh no, my unit's then gonna the know I'm the traitor. Oh no, they're gonna try and kill me, and I'm gonna have oh to kill dear. them. My quarry has cast you aside. How tragic. <sighs> Fans of yours? <laughs> Fans of power. Didn't you know? You and I are living legends. I got this. Sir. Oh, isn't it exciting? The two of us together again at long last. Picture it. A duel to end all duels. Are we fighting or what? Let's not get ahead of ourselves. But I really want to fight him again. First, the music. Let's not forget the lights. <laughs> This is like a dead rising boss. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, let's have a wee look here. Sorry, it's weak to fire. That's fine. It should say number of times defeated one, actually. Oh, there he goes! Jesus! I'm gonna need to block him a lot. when I need to heal. Difficult next time, ladies. Oh, wait, maybe he's gonna. Gentlemen, I give you your champion. What do you mean? <laughs> I must say, you have proven yourself as a capable leader of men. Then again, I expected nothing less than the best. 
As a leader of my own band of brothers, I hold you in the highest respect. And so for you, our fearless captain, a gift. I insist. Okay. That's your cue to exit. Yonder elevator will take you down. And to your ship. I don't trust sure. him. I'll be right behind you. <laughs> Suit yourself. Really? I bid you bon voyage, my friend. Run along now. Shouldn't keep your comrades waiting. Huh. See, when it comes to him, like, trust nothing, you know? Especially when he's like, yeah, yeah, all right, off you go. You destroyed my bike, so that's that. Just want to double check that we got everything. I'm just happy that all my friends are making it. Hopefully. I think I will be really upset if now anything was to happen to my squad, you know? There's always so much stuff to take. Hello? You guys head Lardboard without me. Sir, I have to ask. Oh, the jackass with the bike? He's... a jackass. That we know, sir. <laughs> what I wanted to ask is, why you keep trying to shake us? Are we really that much of a burden to you? <sighs> or... Are you the assassin everyone's looking for? For what it's worth, I want you to know. I'm sorry. <laughs> no need to take the joke that far, Captain. We know the culprit's a young woman. Just lightening the mood. But we get it. You clearly have things to do. Things you can't divulge to us. We're sorry that we didn't see it sooner, sir. Sorry, sir! It's okay. At ease. The fact is, we would have never won that commendation if you hadn't brought us all together. I might be out of line for saying this since we only just met, but the Seventh feels more like a family than ever, and we hope you feel the same. You're not out of line. It's been an honor, Trooper. Oh my god! Right. It's time you guys went your way, and I went mine. Will we see each other again, sir? <laughs> Count on it. Oh. That was like the best scene. I love you guys. Why is that cutting me up? It just, oh my gosh. Bye guys. I am actually crying. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm in bits. I don't know why. It just touched me. Oh God. I love you guys. And they're still there. Oh, man. Oh, God. Yeah, I got tears in my eyes. Oh. Oh, I don't even know how I'm getting on a bloody boat now because I got tears in my eyes. I feel like if I look up and they're still there. They're still there.
I don't know why, it was just like the respect coming from the mall was just it was really you think nice. Are safer in town now? I'm just relieved the president is up. Can we please uh, uh, Hey Red who's behind that attack? <sighs> you okay? Yeah. Great. Now then. Let's not keep our friends waiting. We better get in line. All right, next. They're screening passengers. What now? We try the back door. I still can't believe that Yuffie did that. Can I help you? Yeah, we're, uh... We are the winners of the President's commendation. As a reward, we got a trip to Costa del Sol. The Commander-in-Chief said that we could hitch a ride on your ship. First time hearing of this. Well, the President's a busy man. Those guys with you, too? <laughs> oh my god! Captain, sorry, but you're needed on deck. The fight's broken out. Looks like we're in for another fun crossing. Got space in second class. Be sure to mind your P's and Q's, huh? A lot of big wigs on board. Why are we you, <laughs> being followed by run. these freaks? I sir. Oh. Oh, and your dog stays in the hold. Got it. Ah. <sighs> Leave him alone. He's not a dog, right? I don't see him as a dog. All clear. Pull up. <laughs> Stop the ship! I have a ticket. Come on, man! You can't leave without me. Aw, it's a shame. I'm a passenger, goddammit! it! Don't turn that thing around. Worst day ever. <laughs> Loses her business and then doesn't get to go to Costa del Sol. Oh wow. Chapter four was mental. Was absolutely mental. Like I loved it. But it was mental. And after our little tear fest there, I think I'm ready for a break. Definitely ready. To go on holiday and to hit the Costa del Sol, you guys. Well, that was hard. The air is different here, isn't it? Compared to Midgar, very different indeed. Though perhaps a little sharp for my taste. Isn't this the guy that dressed up Cloud? <sighs> it's been that long since I played the first remake, but I think it is. For a little reconnaissance. That's gonna make me cry too, and I don't know why. I think I've hit an emotional Ever like phase right now. <laughs> no, but there are times when I think I do, and I freeze up till I realize it's someone else. I bet. I'm here if you want to talk. Well, actually, I was kind of hoping we could talk business. Uh, what kind of business? You know business boys oh 
that kind. <laughs> it's me. <sighs> Meeting adjourned for now. So how's it looking up top? All the robes are in second class. Haven't seen any sign of Shimmer, though. We can ditch the uniforms. Aww. Well, it's been an honor, Captain. Captain? Hey, about this deal Rufus wanted to make with you. I know it's off, thanks to little Miss Ninja's stunt, but personally, I think she did us a favor. Nothing good ever came from making deals with the devil. Shinra can't be trusted, no matter who's in charge. Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. Good evening, and welcome aboard the Shinra 8. We're sailing smoothly towards Costa del Sol, and expect to arrive right on schedule. Though your time with us may be brief, we wish you all a pleasant voyage. As for this evening's onboard entertainment, we will be holding a Queen's Blood tournament in the lounge. No, Any anything but. Are welcome to join regardless of experience. See the lounge staff for details. You heard the man. To the lounge. <laughs> Come on. The music here is so relaxing. Gosh, it's beautiful. All right, you guys. I think I'm done. <laughs> what an episode it's been. Oh, wow. Perfect. Junon was everything I had hoped it would be from the parade to the Yuffie craziness to the squad seven at the end there. Just everything, everything was perfect. Oh. All right, you guys, thank you so, so much for hanging out with me today with some more Final Fantasy seven, and I'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye.